Hello and welcome back to the Vinyl Review. Now this is quite an exciting one, so this is Bicep Isles uh, unboxing. Now I ordered this, or rather it was ordered for me as a present, um, before Christmas. So this is a delayed Christmas present, this is the 26th of January 2021. Um, I have the, the first album which is just called Bicep Bicep, it's the self-titled first album. Now this was a Brilliant album, actually loved it. It was a bit of a bit of an surprise. So I listened to um, some of the tracks from for Miles that had been played on the radio. Looked up Bicep to find out who they were. Discovered they um, didn't have those tracks released yet as an album, um, but did track down some of their previous work, and that's where I found the first album. And what's nice about the first one, just a quick look at this, is the artwork. And this is a very sort of Sort of uh, mottled kind of textured finish wrap and the artwork on this is unique to to these so they come in um sets of four and you it's kind of potluck as to what you get what sort of design is going to be on it um, so that was pretty special when i ordered that now let's have a look and see what the new album holds in store so ooh, that's one of these okay so let's go for it. straight in. Uh, now I believe this is the same process where there are several different options and you sort of get whatever artwork you get. Let's have a look. Uh, let's take that. Okay. I like it already. Uh, okay. What do you, so, so this is signed. I'm gonna to have to change the uh, the title on the video. This is a signed copy, by the looks of things. I thought that had been opened accidentally then, but no, it's actually been opened so they can sign it. So I assume that has been signed by by set themselves. How cool is that? Didn't see that coming. Right. So um, if you haven't heard it already, Atlas is the the sort of big banger track on this album. Um, Check it out anyway. Go see what you go see what you can find. Um, it's an amazing track, and that is one of the tracks that led me to buy the first album, which led me to order this album or to request for it as a present. Um, so what have we got on the side? We've got just says bicep aisles on the side. Now I wonder if there's a bit of I wonder if there's any continuity. No. So this always gets me wondering when you have these. I don't know if if you're like me and you have albums stacked up in your collection. I would assume you would have. Your bicep albums side by side. Now I quite like it when there's a bit of continuity with with albums or with, from bands, and they put the uh, the title and the name next to each other, so it kind of all runs in a row. Um, I guess artists maybe want a bit of variety or some difference, and they, it's up to them where they put it. But I quite like it when you get some that really go for a nice, you know, you get every album will have it in the same place in sort of chronological order. Um, but hey, that's just me. That's what I would like. So. I think we're safe because this is a gatefold. We can go straight away and remove this. I think it's already done. Let's peel this off. Again, this is a lovely textured finish. I mean, you can't see it in there. There's nothing to see, but you can. It really has a nice sort of textured finish to it. Lovely bit of artwork there. This kind of I don't even know what you would call that. What are they hands? It looks like hands. I think. Maybe it's some kind of dance form, I don't know. Look at that sign, isn't that cool? That's nice that they signed the back, actually. I know you might want to display it as signed, but you know, for them to sign the front would probably ruin the artwork, so you can still have that framed and on display. Let's have a look inside. Wow, check that out. That is cool. I like it. So we've got all the uh, artist thanks and the production information on that side and then a kind of wide gatefold spread of all the information looking good I like that no, I don't I don't think these were colored vinyl I believe they are just plain black I think there is an option to order this kind of pink if you like um, but I believe when you do that it comes in a three LP set and personally that's just too many times getting up off the sofa and turning it over for me so 
two is fine. One would be even better. A single vinyl would be even better. Artists out there, take note. Please produce more single LP albums. I'm sure there's a reason they don't, but what's that? A bit damage or no? Just a bit of just a bit of vinyl pressing excess. No problem there. Fantastic. I like it. I like the sort of randomness of that as well. It's a lovely rich blue, and obviously that's mirrored in some of the artwork. So let's place that back in there. And for a bit of argument's sake, let's take a look at the other one. Let's see what's in here. I don't know. I don't know if there's a download. No, no download card. Bit of a shame, but that's okay. Oh, different colour. Oh, lots of static going on there. Ooh, I dig that. Cool. You can hear it. You can hear the static. Lovely. Very cool. Now, again, artists and labels, take note. Put plastic inserts in your sleeves, please. But small, uh, small moan about the inlays. Otherwise, a lovely textured feel album and how very cool that it is signed by the artist. 